The little fink is spilling it to Gordon right now. Let me have one. Be inside and take care of it. Keep it quiet. No. No. She's in the it's big black dudes. No. <laughs> We're gonna have to move on to some Batman talk because I saw this yesterday. Please now, don't. Now I I know nothing Please about Batman, this, but I think Mike really wants to talk about this. Look at Mike. Why are you pretending to be Beardo over there? It's not it's not it's good. <laughs> I know some why I just um it's it's it's, it's cringe protection. Protects my eyes from the garbage that I'm looking at. What are we doing? So why are everybody is, fat? Like just just curious. So you're telling me the middle chick is Harley Quinn? No, the one on the end. The left, yeah. That's the Harley Quinn. The Asian chick is Harley Quinn. The and middle chick is Renee an Montoya. And then the chick on the way on the right is Barbara Gordon. And this takes place what in the in the forties, if I'm not mistaken. I believe it's the forties. Yeah, it's like yeah. yeah, when Batman first showed up, like that's an ode to his first costume and stuff. How, yeah. It looks nothing like Harley Quinn. Bro, it looks like garbage. And I'm like, and here's the thing: if you actually want to go back and do accurate period pieces, none of those women were that fat. Nobody had enough food to be that fat. Yeah, no. that is true. Well, the food was healthier. And the food was he yeah. Well, they boiled everything back then. But like, here's single the thing. food ingredients. What are we doing, man? And I knew this. Like, listen, I knew Renee Montoya was going to be in this. You saw the question in the trailer briefly, and Renee Montoya became the question, and everybody's like obsessed with her. She's like the worst part of Birds of Prey. She's not an interesting character. She's like a detective. Oh, cool! Wow, I've never seen that before. That's pretty awesome. But like, why did they change Harley? She doesn't have her accent. She's not, you know, Miss the J. Where you at? Like, we're not going to get any of that. Because it, because Amazon has a very specific checklist, and Wait, they told everybody. To did you yeah. not have her voice acting? I have yeah, not have listened to her He's voice acting. Oh, sucking! I don't want to listen to her. Shall we? Shall I play this for you? Please all? don't. I'm sorry. There's an emergency with the patient. Oh. Tell you what. Meet me later at Hopper's on Wilson and Lowry. We'll pick up where we left off. They're once again making fat lesbians boring, but it's like, what was the voice acting? Why is the accent there? She's like, hey, meet me later. We'll have some fun and pick up where we left off. You know, like, why are we doing Asian and still have a fucking accent? Listen, stop playing in the stereotypes. I'm fucking sick of it. Give the Asian woman a sexy body and let her have the fucking joint the accent or whatever the fuck this is. Boston, I don't know. But she's she got the jet and we don't have She's going so high pitched that Mike can't pick her up anymore. <laughs> what are we doing? I'm so angry. What are we doing? Don't fucking angry that's not like, batman that's not harley quinn what are we not, doing it's not batman it's everything bruce tim like what are you doing man like, it's not that difficult it really the animated isn't. series one of the most uh, critically acclaimed beloved cartoon series ever of all time one of the best and all they had to do was go, hey, we're doing kind of like a new reboot of it in like a different time zone. Everybody loves like the noir feel of it and everything. They wanted to be slightly different. And instead they were like, yo, you know what we could do is just put a bunch of fat lesbians in it. Isn't that cool? It's You're like, so nah, not stupid. really. Bro, what is this garbage, bro? What is this garbage? Like this is, this. oh my God. It's so You're sucky. very it's close to being, time. brother, ooh. Ooh, brother. Ooh, brother. Ooh, brother. Ooh. What's that, brother? What's that? We need Ooh, that brother. On the Listen. Uh, yes. Well, it, it, the thing is, it's a slam. It's it's one of those things. It's an easy layup. And if you want to include Renee Montoya, if you want to do this thing with Harley Quinn, then do it. But like, I don't understand the concept of even making Harley Quinn Asian. Like, there's this new this this new push because you know the thing is a lot of people don't realize harley quinn isn't from the comic books she's from the animated mm -hmm. series she was written specifically to be joker's girlfriend and then he treats her like garbage and abuses her because guess what that's what bad guys do yeah they abuse you people can't have that anymore and, no. and then a bunch of weirdos wanted to have a relationship like those two and thought it was cute and cutesy yep and now all of a sudden it's toxic and they go, yo, mm -hmm. we, we need to split Harley off. We need to do our own thing. And now she's like an Asian, like, like any of her lesbian. costume doesn't even look, her costume doesn't even look normal. Yeah. Not and that's the other thing that. too, is like, yeah, they're like, oh no, uh, I'm not, I'm not with Mr. J anymore. I'm not obsessed with him. Uh, like, dude, what are we doing, man? Like, uh, bro, this is garbage.
I, I hate I can't stand and this is the same guy. Like Bruce Tim worked on the animated series. He knew what made that show good. And this shows that like these people have just been waiting in the wings. They either been waiting in the wings for puts this garbage out and somebody stopped them from doing it, or they've become so insane over the last 20 years that they don't even know what good art is anymore. Like this is wild. This is the same guy that reinvented Mr. Freeze and turned him from like a, a goofy, weird one-off character in the comic books to what we know as Mr. Freeze now, like the cold calculating doctor. Like, dude. Is there like, someone I, above them who's doing this? Like, like who, who sat know. there and said that this was a good idea? Because do they not want to hurt his feelings? Were the Fifi's involved? I just don't understand this. How does this explore or change Harley Quinn at all? Like, are they are they tapping into the fat Asian lesbian side of her with poor voice I, acting? And like, the thing is, Renee Montoya's like big shtick is that she's a lesbian. That's like probably her biggest claim to fame is that she's that's a lesbian, and she yeah. becomes the question later. But like, that's it. That's her whole shtick. And like now, because Harley isn't with Joker, they're like, well, she has to be with somebody, and so ivy's not around so let's just make her be with renee montoya and that's the other thing too is like you can't these these people don't like <laughs> it's wild you don't even understand like what is like what lesbians are like they don't just like make out with every woman they meet no like that's no. not even how like regular people operate and stuff they're just like oh well if, if she's a lesbian then every female character probably should be into her and she should probably be into them but like why nobody cares about any of that where's batman Imagine watching a Batman show and not having any goddamn Batman. And that's not even talking about the 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 penguin. Oh yeah, Oswald the Cobblepot. Like some Bro, bad she, fan fiction crossover. Some... Bro, she's got straight up. If you got a picture of her, look at that big back energy. Listen, I'm a big dude. I'm a heavy set, overweight man, and that that bitch has got big back energy, bro. That look her her shoulders. back her back and shoulders are so big, bro. I can't. It looks like she's wearing a bulletproof vest. It looked like she got stung by a bee up top, bro. And the other thing is, too, she's supposed to be the penguin. You know how tall the penguin is? He's four. He's four foot six. And got poor posture. He's super tiny and small. And they're like, yo, all right, well, let's reimagine the penguin as a female. Okay, then make him the make her the weird, gimpy, ugly penguin. No. They would never do her, that. No, let's make her tall, look like a man, and have big back energy, bro. What's the Th voice that's acting even... for that? I haven't heard... I, I don't know. It doesn't look good, though. I haven't it, it seen anything. Let me see if I can find something. She probably talks like this. Hey, Batman, it's me, the hey, penguinette. Bat. You're fucking it's... ready to go. <laughs> yeah, I've got my I've got my umbrella inside. It's not bad luck when I do it. I'm wearing a tux. Doesn't that make me cool? It's ma'am. <laughs> it's ma'am. It's ma'am. <laughs> bro, this is awful, bro. Like, what are we doing, man? All right, I think I found something. We'll see. Ah! The little fink is spilling it to Gordon right now. Let me have one. Be inside and take care of it. Keep him quiet. No. No. She's in the big black dudes. No. <laughs> no. She's coming for you, Mike. She's in the big black dudes. <laughs> Is this Did you hear that guy's voice? Yeah. She's yeah. Oh. Hey, baby, how you doing? She's like, Look. get back. Make sure you meet me at home. We got <laughs> stuff to do. They needed to adapt Jim Stephanie Sterling for the animated series, okay? And I think they succeeded. That's crazy, bro. I what hate the American doing? voice acting industry face. as a whole because they just do not treat it with respect or passion. I don't care. There are some good voice actors, but as a whole, this is a fucking joke. There's no direction. These poor people are not told to actually emote. They're just reading off of a script, and they all sound, Oh, you soy Dora. Do you know how to say La Mapa? Like, they all sound like they're just one, one step away from being in a kid's show. Yeah. So funny. Zombie's so turning red. How angry she is right now! I, yeah. I get. I'm so passionate about this shit. I swear to God. Like I always wanted to be a voice actress. Couldn't get into it because I didn't suck dick. So it's just I, I'm always on the outside looking in. Like you fucking Americans are filth. You make us look like a joke. We got we. I don't even understand what they're saying. Why do you say it like you're not an American? Because 
I, I'm a first generation American. I'm barely American. No, you have too much of a New York you accent to pretend like you're not American. Blabs I don't have is a less New York accent. Yeah, you do. Just like Blabs has a Canadian accent that she tries to hide all the time because Blabs is actually Canadian. I don't know. Listen, Look, okay, so I was born in New York. There's no way I still have that accent. I grew up in Texas, but I yes, did my you best do. to get rid you of it. You do have a yeah, New York you, accent. There's no you, way you I, get, I don't have that accent of, anymore. Uh, I, I think I'm like a Canadian. Boston. You literally like, said I was Boston. born in America, but you know what? You Americans ruin this. No, well, because they're, they're still the American voice actors. Those Americans specifically make it look like a joke. It's Wild, fucking frustrating. Bro. Accent. Boston. Would you rather I talk in a southern accent? Because I can do that one. It's pretty good. Yeah, anyway. you should just stick with that. Yeah. Uh, are, you, are you guys... Oh, like ready to move no, on we're not okay, that. Blabs. You keep I, asking I this question. I didn't ask oh, if you're okay. I didn't ask if you're okay. It's very obvious you're not okay. But I'm asking if you're ready to move on from the next topic I, to feel a little bit we better. We probably should be. It's just gonna make me more angry. Okay. Craig, like I said, Craig is watching this whole thing go down. And he's like, "What have I done? Yeah. I'm never gonna get invited like back." Like Anakin on this Skywalker. Show again. What have I yeah. done? What 